welcome to delish food channel today i'll be showing you spinach pasta in red pumpkin sauce now for that i'm going to first blanch the palak now here i have taken one fourth uh, you get a whole bunch of uh, palak from that i have taken one fourth portion and here i have boiled some water now what i will do i will close this gas and i went into this hot water after closing the gas i have blanched palak for 2 minutes now i will remove it from here and i will put it into a very chilled water to stop its further processing this is called a shock treatment now i will let it get cooled completely and then i'm going to make a fine puree into a mixer grinder now into this i have taken 1 cup of wheat flour and into that i have added salt to taste little very little sauce and here i have made the uh, spinach puree now i will add this spinach puree here this i am making a dough for the pasta okay now i will start kneading it i will knead a semi soft dough so here my pasta dough is ready now i will put a lid over it and i will allow it to rest for 10 minutes meanwhile we will prepare for the red pumpkin sauce so for that i'm going to first saute the red pumpkin sauce uh, the red pumpkin into the oil now here i've taken one ladle oil and 1/4 teaspoon of butter now into this i'm going to add lower the gas flame one bay leaf then half inch cinnamon stick then five cloves and about 10 black pepper corns i will saute it for a minute or two and then immediately i'm going to add this red pumpkin and i will allow it to get cooked till it softens it's now almost 2 minutes been i've been cooking okay now at this point i'm going to add 1 tablespoon of cashews to give it a creamy texture and also i'm going to add 1 tablespoon of freshly grated coconut 1 1 to 2 tablespoons i'm adding 2 tablespoons okay that's enough more than enough not more than this and i will first mix it properly i will cover this and i will allow it to get cook completely now see it's almost now 4 minutes i've been cooking it in between this was not cooking as required so what i have done i have added half kotori water and half teaspoon turmeric powder now this is come been completely cooked okay now what i will do i will allow this um, sabji or a red pumpkin to cool completely down and meanwhile i will show you how to make pasta so now i'll be showing you how to make that spinach pasta for that i have i have kept some water for boiling into this water i have added salt to taste now i will lower the gas flame little bit and i will add half the ladle of oil into this okay and now we will start making this pasta so here i will just knead this properly again okay now what i will do i will first swirl it here like this and with the help of a scissor now i'll be cutting it like this and i will cook it till al dante it is not to be cooked till it softens little bite should be there so say about 4 5 minutes i'm going to boil it it's 
now almost 10 minutes I've been boiling this pasta now I will put the flame off and I will give it a shock treatment by putting it into cold water and now let's start preparing sauce so here I have already made this fine paste of pumpkin red pumpkin which we have sauteed now you have taken one ladle of normal oil and one tablespoon of butter now into this i'm going to add this onion which i have finely chopped one small onion or medium size of onion you can say medium size only and i will saute it for not more than one minute here I have made one coarse paste of half is ginger, one green chili, very spicy, and uh, say about two garlic cloves. I have pounded it, and that's all. Now, this also I'm going to saute it for not more than one minute. I've been sorting it for a minute. Into this, I have added salt to taste. Now we will add this paste. And some water I will be adding some water into this mixer grinder we will not waste the paste and I will add that water into this in order to cook it so my pumpkin sauce is ready now I have added almost one katori water you know into that mixer grinder and I have added and I have reduced it till this thick consistency now before serving I have added one small teaspoon of butter into it and I have done. now let us start serving so here I have taken the boiled pasta here like this okay now into this I am going to serve this sauce okay like this I have added only salt that's all and on the top of this this is optional I am grating some cheese if you like you can add so this my pasta into the pumpkin sauce is ready if you are still new onto my channel and not yet subscribed please do subscribe my channel like today's video and try sharing my video with your family and friends as much as possible and make this it taste simply awesome if you want you can add on the top of it little um, garam masala and even you can add kasuri methi even that gives it an amazing taste thank you